video, we're going to show you how to apply a car decal to a back window through a process called wet application. So to start, let me move this over here. You want to make sure that you're starting with a nice, clean back window. <laughs> a mixture of dish soap and water, just a few drops of dish soap and about a cup of water, and spray it onto the back of the window and also on the back of the decal. But before we do that, we need to flip our decal over and give it a good rubbing with a squeegee just to make sure that all the letters are stiff. Next, with our decal still face down, we'll start to peel back I'm going to do this slowly and keep the backing as flat as possible to make sure all the letters stay down. Next, we're going to spray the back of our decal with our mixture of dish soap and water. all your letters are coated and then we get to spray the back of the window. Now you don't have to worry too much about getting it straight and even because the point of what application is you can move it around. So then we'll take our squeegee and we're going to first of all smooth it out but also make sure all of our water and dish soap solution is being pushed out from under the decal. For a minute, it's okay. Okay. Right. So, depending on how much of the solution you use, you'll probably need to let it sit for a little bit. For example, we used a good bit, so we had to let it sit for maybe 20 minutes to dry. So, once it's all ready, you can feel it, it's dry. <laughs> Go ahead and peel it back from the corner. Try to keep this application tape flat so that the letters come off easily. any of the letters start to stick, you just kind of push it back down with your finger. Keep it like that, for example. Push it back in place. Another important reason for keeping your tape flat. It's still a little wet, you'll still be able to wiggle it around until it gets just right, too. You'll notice it's still a little bit damp. So then just let it set in the sun for a little, and then clean up around your edges, and it should be good to go.